Did I sound upset? I have my reasons. When you meet so many women, you, suddenly you, you don't think straight. You understand? You don't think straight because you have only one girl and that is that is to create a streamline a social life with other people in Denmark. What they have closed down for me before I begin to notice what the fuck they was doing. Now it was this when I was on a run in the seven days in the, from the mental hospital. Because there shall go seven days from the mental hospital when you break out from that place. And I waited just to the day that they decide that I should have medicine out there. Because there's shit medicine. Do you know what it's doing with your head? And the front of your head is getting so dry so you cannot put the anger down if you understand what I mean. So dry is it getting. Your eyes too is getting so dry and I have eyes already that's dry. That's not everything. You will begin to talk like this. So that's how you begin to talk. That's just telling a little bit what that's happening inside your head. It's not something good. So what have I done since I shall have this treatment? Because they haven't really not told me. <laughs> they have not told me at all. But the cause is why I'm in there. They, they say it's because of my stories that I t I'm telling them. But I know it's not because of those stories. So they have not told me at all what the reason is I'm in there. I'm still putting a question up what the reason is that they put me in there. Understand this. I have not been in court. I have not could defend myself uh, in, in no level at all. They've just said I'm sick and I should out out there. Even when my uh, neighbors is knocking me down out here, then it's me. <laughs> Just because I have a fucking bike and I don't have no money in the month, then they want me to uh, drive all the way out to the police station, you know? And not only here, you know, all the way out to... Uh, to what do you think? It doesn't matter. Should I uh, drive all the way out there just to, to uh, say they have attacked me out here? Uh, they can just look up in the hospital and then they can see it. It's not such a fucking big problem. So why can I not just call and say it? But that's the police. That's our Denmark. So it's corrupt. Everything is just fucked up. See, when when you have idea that your woman shall be Danish <laughs> and and they have fuck, fuck 10 years of your life up because they want to force you with something else see in the end you doesn't really care anymore you simply as that just just that she is Danish and she is not older than yourself Do you understand what I'm saying? That, that, that's what my neighbors have caused. <laughs> Not only that, I've just met this woman when I was on run. And um, you know now the color pink is is the is the color on the medicine on the hospital, you know? And not only that, they are uh, calling it 
Pink Diamond too. You know? Because you will get a face that's so fucking golden. Who cares? So this woman have colored her hair pink. So when I met her in the town, because I have just stand and talk with another woman, she said she was from Northwest. Same place as my neighbor upstairs. And this was, was where the medicine industry is. In, in uh, where they studied their shit in Copenhagen. Now I meet this woman and she have her hair color pink. And she said to me too that she have a boyfriend. So. The reason. I just. Try to put up some social, social people around me. Not this fuck that's sitting around me. I, I know she have a boyfriend. She said it to me. I make an appointment with this woman. That we're just going to take a cup of coffee to just talk. But now my phone is reacting in the same fucking way, <laughs> like all the years. So I've only talked with her in the phone one time. The question is just, she have a pink color hair. So she could be a part of their shit organization who have put this on me to force me with a woman. Because... They have hired uh, so many fucking women's. They have hired so many fucking women's who is in cooperation with this shit, trying to force me with with somebody so they can f get some shit out of it. I was curious about she was a part of that shit. I want to know more about it. I just know she have a color hair pink. So I want to know why she color her hair pink for the first. Is it because it's just on a mode, you know? Is it in, you know? Is it because people find my videos with the uh, pink respital shit medicine that my videos is uh it's a great success and uh Is that why they call it because they like my shit or do they call it because they are part of of their shit every fucking where sitting over people's lives in their fucking phone That was my question That was what I want to find out but they've already cut the line and she's definitely not writing a SMS back and say, I call you later. Because that's what is happening fucking all, every time. Nobody is writing you back, you know. Every fucking time I call somebody, they don't send me a SMS back. Hey, I call you later. Or I did not take the phone or something like that. I cannot speak right now. Or you, you know, the normal stuff with people in your fucking phone. No, no, it's just going on an answer machine. First time I called her, she said it was her mom that was taking the phone. That's my question too. Because I know they are speaking like this, mom and dad. From the corporation of the organization they are from. How can somebody just take some people out there and then just put their shit religious fuck over their fucking life 